guess there's not really much reason to watch people trickle in. I mean, all I really want to do is check out what's going on with the characters. See who I get. See if I'm going to be monetarily irresponsible, briefly. You know, all that good stuff. But really, all I want, all I really want, is that auto deploy. I think that's really it. I mean, you know, a new event, very cool. New characters, very cool. All stuff I've been through before, but auto deploy. Are you kidding me? Being able to repeat that multiple times. That's wild. Anyhow, let's go ahead. I'm not going to say get into it. Because you know we're about what we're about to do. Actually, wait, <laughs> do I have? I, I really have no reason to do that, so I'm not going to do that. I was going to do like the immersive lighting again, but why would I do that for this game? Anyhow, you get the idea. It's it's time for the thing that I've been waiting for for several weeks. Wait, I downloaded the updated, right? If I didn't, well, I guess we're about to find out. Welcome home, doctor. Okay, I did. I'm pretty sure this was one of the months, one of the rare months. Every single day, I probably logged in. I think it's been a while. But I got every single one of those monthly card days. Am I going to get the monthly card again? Well, I don't know. We'll see. But first things first, we must claim the login thing for every other, every other, oh wait, okay, is that a thing for, what is that for, for Meteor? Yeah, I guess Meteor gets outfits and stuff pretty often, I mean, I still use it sometimes, oh, it's one of these again. I always do the riskier one, because why not? I want to get more, so. Hey, got more. And I think, yeah, on these days it increases, or I guess it changes. I don't know. I think maybe you get extras. I have never really quite understood that. I click on a thing, it gives me stuff. And yes, I know my thing expired. I still think this is the funniest. Like, they're trying to say it really is. It's really a shame to let go of all those precious resources. Like, all right, cool. Sure, sure, sure. I mean, I've I've honestly been logging on to the game a lot more. So maybe, maybe I'll re-up that. Wait, why does that do that now? I don't know. It usually doesn't black out the screen while it's... Oh. I mean, I guess it just did right then. Uh, This is literally like my... I didn't like it do pre... Um, I guess sometimes I, I just... I'll be offline or in the Discord and stuff, and I'll just do all the stuff beforehand. 
I didn't do that this time. I mean, I basically just got home. So, you know, you'll have to watch me go through the motions of all that stuff because I can't help it. It's just like, it's an ex well, instinctual at this point. But no matter what, I will get these two. So it means I won already. Whether I got somebody else or not. Oh, wait, hold on. What were the changes for these characters? Are they? Oh, that must be the new voices or wait, is it? I thought he had an English voice already. Did he not? I mean, I guess I wouldn't know. Oh wait, maybe it's a, a different voice because obviously. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think that's a different dub because these are characters that had English voices already. So it's just new dubs for different, for some characters, I think. A few of them might not have had it before. I'm pretty sure she had one though. She has a Russian one. That's interesting. Wait. Yes, I know this isn't rolling, but you know. Still curious. Неплохое местечко. Все следует правилам и сосредоточено на работе. Идеальное островное убежище, изолированное от остального мира. Sounds really nice. But yeah. Rhodes Island is a nice place. Yeah, we'll just keep everybody insistently as in English as they can. But only because I, I like that they do instruct people to... Wow, it really does seem like they have some regional voice stuff. That I actually didn't realize. That's really cool. I guess he has a simulation now. I'm not doing it though. Paradox simulations are really irritating. <laughs> not my favorites. Wait, are these modules? Uh oh. What could they possibly do to improve Mudrock? 15% less damage? Wait. What's that normally? Uh, she doesn't have two of them. So I guess it's just a flat decrease of damage. And more restore for everything else. Hey, I mean, why not just make the best even better? I'm not going to do that now, though. Penance is probably maybe traditionally a bit more in need of some stuff. Maybe they did something specific. 15% less damage. I guess that's something. More barrier stuff. Equal to 70% of max as opposed to 50% of max. Well, that's, that's pretty good too. Vigil. I guess that's it's a paradox simulation. Probably not going to take that. Now, what could they have given you? 115%. Ignore 25% defense. Uh, what's the second one? Blocks one enemy. Oh, Ruby and Ronan. Wait, you seem to be kind of on a little early. Where am I? Oh, <laughs> wait, are, were these not related? Was, was this just a whim that both of you had at the same time? Were you not doing a collab? Oh, well, I mean, that's funny. 
Alright, well, I guess you just have the same brain cell. I'm just over here doing random stuff, so hello. Hi. Also, I'm really looking forward to your uh, debut stuff. I hope that goes well. I mean, I could be talking to either of you, but to Ruby in this case. But uh, let me shout. Well, okay. I'm sorry, but Ronan beat you by second. So I will shout out Ronan first. Uh, there you go. By a, did that? Okay, that worked. Yeah, like a millisecond before. It was almost the exact same time. And yes, this means I now hate you. But um, obviously, I think, I think in terms of audiences, I mean, yeah, you know, you're probably familiar enough with each other. But, uh, you know, I've interviewed both of these lovely people before. If you want to check out those episodes of my podcast that I do, uh, I didn't say who I was, but I mean, you read the thing. They probably introed me. So, you know, I'm just sitting around playing an update of Arknights. Arknights is one of my favorite games to play. Sorry. There's like a noise going on. Uh, I don't even know if that picked up. I don't know how to stretch. So that's a, a fake one. I hate water, so that's a fake one too. Get scammed. Um, that's uh Oh, let me do the other shout out for... Hmm. For Ruby. By the way, what were you playing? I mean, I, I could probably guess what Ruby was playing, but... I mean, you never know. Oh, I have to wait 30 seconds, too. Hold on a second. Oh, Monster Hunter World Story. Interesting. Do you find it to be actually a pretty interesting story, or does it... I mean, I guess I don't really know very much about... Uh, I mean, I know... Okay, it's a stupid thing to say, but it's a world with a bunch of giant monsters. It's like... I've never quite understood why they bothered. But I mean, I guess it's probably like... It's something. Do you have to actually do all that in order to start playing multiplayer? Or what do you have to do to start doing multiplayer? Is it just, is it just like a first mission? Because I know that that kind of got in the way of like having to do story missions in order to unlock other stuff. The first mission. Hmm. Okay, let me try the shout out now. Uh, why did I put an underscore there? Maybe. Me. Uh, okay. So they did something better with Iceborne then. Alright. Okay. Hold on. I'm just clicking through things here. I suppose it's, it's about the same. I'm just... Frankly, for a lot of these, I, it seems like they they added Russian voice acting for few of them. I I don't know if that's what they added though, because it's I think it is because these characters already had English voices. Interesting. Unless they just dubbed them again with different people, which I'm not too sure why they would do that. I mean, they've done it once, but. They do tend to instruct them to do accents and things like that, so that's pretty cool. Wait, why does she have another module? I could have sworn she already had one. Weird. Because I already have, like, all of this and everything, too. So is it a new one? Was the podcast coming back? Uh, I think what I decided and then forgot to, like, tell them to announce was that I want to do it seasonally, kind of. So... Maybe like around when the anniversary of 
Monopolis starts again, which I kind of forgot when that was. I think it was like September or something like that. But I don't know. I feel like I don't want to do it year round because I can't quite think of a way to do that without going outside of uh, Monopolis for it. And I, I guess in a sense, like this might be somewhat um, cruel, maybe a bit direct, but I was mostly kind of waiting to see like who all was like down or like kind of down to be more involved with Monopolis and wanting to the end because sometimes um sometimes you'll get people saying like i want to do this i want to do this but then eventually they kind of end up like moving on or whatever so yeah i kind of feel like less frequently might work too but i like doing it weekly when it's on so i still kind of wanted to load up episodes too but yeah, I, I'm sure you understand what I mean with that. Like, yeah, there's there's been things happening for one reason or another, like people just genuinely getting busy or kind of moving on in one way or another. So I feel like after now seeing like who's in and like down to do stuff and all of that, I feel like I want to not base it directly on that but not just like blanket introduce everybody and then have it be a case where there's just like uh, awkward episodes where that's the only thing that they ended up really doing so you know it is what it is and i i can pretty much see that it's about everybody I mean, there's, there's some people who are a little bit MIA still, but everybody's got their reasons. So Hi, we shall see. I'm spot from operation reserve team a six. My job is to, by the way, how's the volume of everything? I, d I don't really know. Wait, yeah. Hi, I'm spot from operation reserve team a six. My job is to protect. Also, the this is a gotcha on my team. So I'm so sorry, Ronan, that you you raided into somebody playing a thing that you are so vehemently opposed to. But I I kid you not, this is this is the one that is the free to play one that everybody says like, oh no, don't worry, this one is this one is fine, this one's good. Don't get me wrong. Just it's still something that you have to handle responsibly. Well, I am very much aware of that, but I'm sure you probably said something, so. I know your reasoning. I know that um, there's different people who think different things about it, but frankly, I would have played this game if it wasn't a gotcha. And frankly, I pretty much could just play balloons or like uh, plants versus zombies, but this just so happened to be the first tower defense game that I ever played. So I think I kind of got more uh, obsessed based on that than anything. So it's like if I want to play tower defense game with anime people or tower defense game with uh, wacky cartoon people like I chose the one with the anime people so it's where my heart's at anyway there's a new banner of limited operators which is a thing that I always still dislike uh, that any game does but limited just you know they have more ways of limited characters returning in this game they have um, a shop that you can basically use to purchase previous limited characters if you would like. <laughs> Only if you roll 300 times, which is not going to happen unless you've been saving up for since three months ago or something. I don't even know the math on that, but 
it is something that is actually possible to do with uh without um well without spending money now am i going to spend money well i got paid today but they did give me this 10 pull here for free because they're that magnanimous you know Now keep in mind, uh, I've seen the majority Hello, of these characters already. Long range sniping's my specialty. You can leave any task to me as long as it's a work day. This guy hits invisible enemies. I am Shirayuki. Princess Fumizuki told me to assist Miss Chen and follow all your orders. This character slows other characters and has a very, very long range. I need a job. And being a pharmaceutical company, surely Rhodes Island won't turn down an experienced plant hunter. And the plant hunter in question is none other than... You are? I just need to sign here, that's it. No fibs. No fibs? Uh, this character is... Hmm. A melee character that dies and instead of actually properly dying on the field summons another character to replace itself and then revives again but if that character gets killed then they die Probably. this character can't be healed but every single time they strike the enemy they speed up and they heal themselves. Show me your brightest smile, my esteemed customer. This character Happiness is a melee is character, when you're by my side. but can fire long range at stuff service. at people and hit aerial enemies. This is a melee character, but also has attacks that can hit aerial enemies. Also, I think I will always say that the thing that I love most about this game is that all of these characters and stuff that I'm like hand waving and blah blah blahing or whatever, they're all actually really useful. So you don't have this. I mean, obviously, yes, hierarchy of like a six star character versus what a three star character can do. It's it's very clear that six star characters are stronger but the game is balanced around the idea of being able to use some of these lower characters to clear everything and there's people who base kind of their entire content around like showing how to use four stars and all of that stuff instead of like just using very very strong characters but genuinely, it is a game where everybody is useful, and if you just like a character, you can just use them. There's not many of those around. Also, this is a game where... Oh, that's a character I have already. Um, this is a game where... Basically, when you get a character, it's just like permanent of, uh, oh yeah, no, that's what I was going to say. With this, you don't have a bunch of weird random equipment that appears preventing you from getting characters, which is something I really, really hate about other gadgets sometimes. Every operator's help at Rhodes Island. It is not my favorite thing to see. I deal with it, but frankly, it wears on my patience so, so easily that it is ridiculous. If a game gives me junk equipment when I'm trying to roll for a character, I am like five times more likely to quit. 
So, you know, I mean, good for them. They're, they're losing out on business for me. It means I don't have to spend more on a game that I don't want to spend more on. Okay. Uh, what was I? Oh, okay, that's right. I, I did find some stuff for this character. Hmm. Can't really level him up though. I don't have a, I don't have a lot of resources and stuff at the moment, but there's a <laughs> there's something that they recently added in this update just now that will be very very helpful, especially for free to play people. Your face could really use a massage. And that is the existence of auto deploying multiple times uh, which is something previously you could not do unfortunately and it took them only four years to figure out that people might want to replay uh, stages multiple times now here's what I'm wondering how does it work let's maybe take a look at that after I do something. Yeah, I still do have a few more single pulls on this banner. I'm, oh, wait a minute. There's something that's bothering me. I see that my capture is moved up by one. And now I must remedy this. Wait. No, not like that. Not like that. How do I move this? Did I move it? No, I didn't. It's like a, a line of pixels at the top. And now I can't. I see that. There we go. No. I put it back. How? Um, is that good? Okay, that's good. There we go. <sighs> hi, hi. I'm this is a sniper. Snipers focus on aerial enemies, but can also hit grounded enemies. That's obvious enough. Hello, I'm Hayes. I like relaxing work environments. Character does magic damage. As you can tell, to the witch hat. Hmm. Who else? I mean, there's no other banners that I'm really going to be rolling on because this one has a limited character, but. Uh, let's just look here. I didn't really have to use that there, but. Hi. I'm Spot from Operation anyway. Reserve Team A6. It's actually probably more rolling than I'm going to do tomorrow. On my team, I guess. Just because tomorrow is April 1st, which means a bunch of monthly stuff would be... Oh, yeah, it would be replenished in about 11 hours, as it says here. I'm probably just going to do that in the morning off stream. Uh, but, you know. When things reset like that, I usually just kind of do that. I guess technically, there's been so long that I've gone without this particular character, Scotty the Corrupting Heart, on this particular account, which has made me, <laughs> it's made me upset because there are so many strategies that use this character but most of the times you can kind of replace her or fudge with the damage a little bit but i did say that no matter what i can purchase these two characters which are new to the thingy okay i'll fact i'll finally actually do the hydrate and the posture check this time. Ow. Uh, let me find my water though. Hold on. 
Also, hi. Can you okay? <laughs> Wait, what does it look like when I do that? to mute because I don't like drinking into the thing. Also, hello, Kuogane Star. Were you from like uh, a few days ago when I last streamed? Wait. Why do I? Hmm. Was it like later in the day? Kind of late at night. I feel like... Oh no, it was from longer ago. Okay. But yes, no matter what, some new characters today. Just standing here already proves I'm tough enough, you know? You're my boss now, so make sure I don't get bored. And be ready for my surprises. Okay. See, we have buddies in this place, of course. I don't know what this character's really about, though. Which name card would you like? The one in my left hand, or the one in my right? The oh, that's right. Gemologist. I'm so stupid. To make your <laughs> I'm not used to you like Don't coming worry. into the. There's no target here worth my attention. The actual Even stream, so it's like, oh yeah, of course. I I remember <laughs> you are now. Because I got you, Jessica. That one time. Yeah, I do like having the hand thing for the um for all of the mobile game streams because I, I feel like just having the cursor sometimes is not enough. Like you can't actually see. So it's especially good, I think, for pointing out the thing. But yeah, the um Caper's the, the loop sniper, I think. Or like the new type that was in there. But no, I'm sorry, that was like, that was weird, because you're literally in there in the Discord most of the time, so it's like, I guess I'm just used to seeing you there. Well, yeah, I mean, you can actually see where things are pointing, so I feel like it's oh, useful. Oh, oh, you saw that move of mine? <laughs> I, the reaction was so funny. Okay. I can't figure out what her deal is. Okay, can only attack while holding a boomerang projectile. Takes some time to return. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? We shall see. I guess I can already do this. All the officers I know are so desperate for promotion. They do all kinds of dirty infighting. So I assume getting promoted had to be super fun. <sighs> and that is no big deal. Well, yeah, I mean, it happened instantly. But, um, yeah, I guess I'm not always, like, streaming Dark Knights itself on the main channel either. I kind of oh, do it more oh, in Discord. Oh, you saw that move of mine? <laughs> Each so attack fires one more boomerang projectile. Okay, so she's um, offense recovery. But that's like, ooh, that's, hmm. 34 is kind of a lot for offense recovery. So I know just the character to pair this person with. That's going to be a case for Mr. Stainless over here. 
That way she can just be attacking all the time. But... And yeah, I think... I could probably also throw... What's her face in there? The, the sniper that has passive recovery for all snipers. I forgot what her name is. But I know there was one. I could probably throw Chen in there too, why not? But... Uh, I guess I'll have to run this multiple times. Luckily, they added a feature where you can do that. But hold on a second. Before I get ahead of myself. What was I trying to do with this? Oh, yeah. The sniper chip. Pack. That's right. Uh, I believe I have some. Yes, I have a lot actually of these and we'll just sit on what's her face for a second where is she bagpipe where's bagpipe bagpipe oh, okay she's over here i don't think she does it was somebody else our shadow i think Okay, so 11 of these, so I'll probably just wait till tomorrow to get those. So not an instant elite two like I wanted, but that's fine, I think. Uh, I mean, I guess I could technically. Wait, ZTA. Did I never do that? So ZTA is uncommon for that, really. Interesting. I guess there's one I could probably do. Oh yeah, Warfarine does that as well. So what, which one of these has just like a double chance to drop them? I could probably just run that one a bunch. Yeah, I could probably just run this one a bunch, right? Auto deploy. Time six. What does that mean? Do I have to sit here and watch it six times or? I mean, I guess I do. Actually, hold on. Wait a second. Let me not get ahead of myself here. Because if it's 410, I kind of want to just do it. Because I like doing this stage. Let's go. Take them all by storm. Right? It's Frost Nova. So. Rather than making you watch this uh, 10 times. Damn well, no. You. Six times. You made a fool out of me. Okay, so it's good to know how this works because I was wondering if it was like a, if it would just be able to tell you if things cleared. But yeah, even if it's just like six at a time, that is just so much better. New game plus? Um, I guess in a sense. Well, yeah, I mean, it's calculating the, the runs of how much it would cost to do it that many times. I think maybe it only tops out at how many you can do at the time. Welcome so home, let Dr. me see that, actually. If I were to do that. Wait, hold on. Let me let me find the, the characters again. Uh, okay. Diamante. Primal caster. Elemental damage. That's not new, is it? I don't think so. Or is it? Well, let me... Let me mark this character. Hold on. And then let me mark... Paper. 
there she is. Well, first off, let me let me make sure to do this part because I can't do this. Then. May as well not do anything. <laughs> Why did I do this with Ling? That's so overkill. Uh, we'll do. Okay. Hold One on. wrong step, and we'll pay a heavy price. I expect perfect. Only the people with no trust. The untrustworthy ones. If conflict is unavoidable, a swift end is a form of mercy. And I did actually manage to get what's its face. Oh yeah, no. Um, there was only one character that dealt an elemental damage before, and that was um Alarkman from the the other thingy. But they also added a module to Ebenholtz for him to deal Effective elemental damage. Video. Free from excessive narration and trite background music. Wait, is he complaining about YouTube videos? Why? He doesn't like the BGM. But yeah, it seems like this is a character specific to elemental damage now. And not just like a supporter that does. I don't normally collect medals for the purpose of this playing status, but if you insist, I will place it at the top of my collection to demonstrate my respect for you. Hmm. I guess I'll just do 50 for now because we're getting so many characters at once. A but... practical video, free from excessive narration and dry background music. Okay. Laser cutter. Attack steal 50 or. Er... Additional 10% of arts damage is necrosis damage. If target is under the burst effect of necrosis damage, deal an additional... Okay. Attack speed plus 50. Attack one additional target. That kind of seems a little better, I would say. So we'll just hop into that. And you know what? For good measure, one wrong step and we'll because pay a heavy price. We're I dealing with uh from elemental damage people. Then we'll go ahead. As foretold. We'll just use you Actually wait, hold on. What care my character am I upping to E2? Hmm. Maybe caper. Well, I can't. Oh, yeah, that's right. I was going to use uh, stainless caper, so I'll just put stainless in here, too. And. Of Self -Salvation Corps, joining up with Rose Island. Just for good measure. One of you. One of you. One of you with offerings recovery. How about that? Gains one DP per attack. Actually, I use puzzle. I never use puzzle. My public activity with Rhodes Island is better kept on the minimum. I don't end. use puzzle because I don't like him. Like personally, it's it, it's personal at this point. He's so annoying. If this conflict truly is necessary. I suppose there's no way around it. I don't even know why I'm like, like he's just kind of a no. He's like a douche. I don't know. All right. Uh. Hmm. Why am I thinking so hard? This is such an old stage. I am not going to back. be given any measure of difficulty by doing this. So. Picked a good place for me. Everyone is literally going to one shot everything. It's fine. Every look you take has value. Okay. Oh. Okay. So her 
range goes behind her too. Interesting. Every expression you make is an opening. So she does prioritize them. So if they're closer. Interesting. So there's an advantage to having her close to everybody. Don't leave it written across your face. Hmm. Wait, I wonder if I if I do this, then who does she target first? Don't leave it written the most recent summon enemy? Yeah, she is slow, but hmm. With with this, every expression you make is an opening. Hmm. What are you waiting for? It's gotta be me. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of wondering, like, Don't leave it what the your face purposes intensely but so she does still prioritize okay no it seems like just she'll attack the enemy that's wandering in to her range or like the newest enemy that comes in I guess Let me... Well, yeah, she probably could solo this. I think probably all of these characters could solo this. Um, Let me go to the other stage that had this. But I think that this one has more... Yeah. This one has more... Um, more of a chance to drop them. And it's got more lanes, so I can observe some more stuff. I didn't even get to use the elemental damage characters at all. Do you need me to tell you all? You seem like a pack of children at a holiday camp. See? He's just like annoying. That was puzzle. Clear out those despicables in hiding. Like every single time somebody says something negative, it's puzzle. Alright. Let's see. <laughs> what should I play with you guys? So it's like the closer they get to her, the sooner the boomerang returns. It's interesting. She's definitely way, um, yeah, the puzzle is like. Negative Nancy. So funny. Don't leave it written across your face. <gasps> I don't know. Yeah, he is. It's like it's crazy. Alright. Uh hmm. Who should I? I shall have the honor to put and leave it written across your face. Yeah, how fast are they? This is the only value of gemstones. Hmm. I see the. Actually, I don't really see what they're doing. Hold on. Oh, yeah, that's right. I've never really summoned him either. So technically, I don't really know what he does. I mean, I do, but he what he does is damage. I can read you like an open book. Okay. What are you waiting? <laughs> I can read you like an open book. All right, so if I keep her over here. I guess technically if I keep him over here too. Your face. Although maybe I shouldn't. Hmm. About time to swing your hammers. Does he attack all blocked enemies? Oh yeah, he does. Okay, that's his whole thing. So that's actually fine. 
if he's just like flailing around. I can read you like an open book. Okay. Now let's try your skill. You wish. strike and take what you cherish the most. Please deliver my vision to the masses. Uh, I'm not seeing the most special thing. No, I like your voice. Don't doubt your sense defied by Ember. Every expression you make is an opening. I mean, she's supposed to be a prankster, so it fits her voice. They're going for a personality type, and they nailed it. I've suddenly lost track of who all is doing what damage, but... Honestly, even for her being like a 4-star, she's doing pretty decent damage. Even with like the double boomerang. Okay, now, now we try the, hmm, wait, did I get enough already? <laughs> Let me just check that. I think I only needed four. Okay, I'm just trying to, Welcome home, doctor. I realize her skill is low at the moment, so that's one of the reasons why she's not like doing all that much more. Because I, I can only also assume that with this being a blue number that she can increase the amount of boomerangs that she's doing right but if she can do three like that's pretty good now let me do this stage with these characters actually let me get a healer in there for this uh, who's the most recent healer that I got? I actually never got the the five star healer that was on the other one. Unfortunately. I still have hibiscus though. But Yeah, I guess Paprika and Reed are the most recent healers that I've gotten. I still like Prep. Paprika a lot. Did I get an outfit for her? I think I did. Or was there an outfit? Oh wait, no, this is the outfit. That's right. Because it just like... Doesn't look different. <laughs> I mean, it is different, obviously, but... You know. It's like red and white versus red and black, I guess. Yeah, it would be nice if it was super fast. Oh wait, hold on. That's the other thing I was gonna do. You picked the right girl for the job. I was gonna put Archetto in just to see. Cause Archetto automatically restores uh, skill points to sniper allies that have offense recovery skills. Literally. And um you know, that's a pretty easy win. I, oh yeah, that's right. There was another uh, Vanguard that increased the attack speed of other snipers while the skill was active. So maybe lining that up could... Maybe that, that could also work, too. I, I can see how you would get annoying from that, but... I don't agree. Be ready at a moment's... Let's clear the place in one fell swoop! Watch every hmm. expression you make is an opening. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to cover the right side pretty quickly. Let's we'll put Samus here. Down to work. 
Every expression you make is yeah, that's true. I think so. Chop chop with the orders. I'll make him regret showing their faces. Hmm. I will put. I'll put Caper here. <laughs> Don't leave it written across your face. And I'll put you here. Chop chop with the old plant looks whiskey, who can tell? Plant looks safe. You're in for hell. Actually, I could just put one of these here too. You wanna get every expression you make is an opening. Oh yeah, that's right, okay. And then I'll put you back here. Actually not. Uh, put you back here. Every look you take has value. Can I switch between Order the default launch. state and the following state. Okay, attack interval increases slightly. Uh, block plus one blocks attack. Ah, uh, okay. Every That's what I wasn't doing. Fight for Londinium! Victory for Londinius! Uh, let me choose here. I can read you like an open book. Actually, hmm, I feel like there's something I should have done. But, oh well. Oh yeah, that's right. That's what I was trying to do. Let me finish before right there. And let's see for right here. Okay. What are you waiting for? Look out! Here comes Brainswell. I can read you like an open. Somewhat haphazard, but I mean. Nothing about this stage is really difficult, so. No longer attacks the enemies below 50%. Okay. I, have, I still have to remember every single time which one she is. I also forgot that he needs healing. As you wish. He's probably gonna die. If anybody walks out that can move. Every look you take has value. This is also not a difficult stage, so I'm not concerned. In the slightest. I get the feeling maybe. Maybe his third skill is more what he's known for. Every expression you but make is an opening. I guess being able to block three is pretty good, but when you have zero defense, that doesn't really mean much. Wait. Oh, I don't I didn't realize when the next one's gonna come out. Okay, see he's almost dead. As they get stuck onto something, it doesn't really matter. No need to hold back. Yeah, this Every is fine. expression you make is an open. Real from darkness. Don't get careless just because I'm here. Wait, she can't heal the crabs, can she? I don't think so. I don't think anything can. There we go. They can just be resummoned. Now we can show ourselves the door and leave. Hmm. Okay. Now I can re uh redeploy, I guess.
We can do a fast Rita boy. Can she kill a boss? Uh, which, which she are you referring to? Okay, so this is 90. Wait. Okay, this is guaranteed, so I actually don't have to repeat it that many times. Because I only need three of this, I think. So. Now we will test out the glorious feature of having a thing repeat multiple times. Embers will hide our footsteps. Caper, uh, I feel like she probably could. Yeah. Don't leave it written across your face. Here's what I would probably do if I were to try and use her, though, because. Obviously, you have to put her, um, you have to put her close to where the boss is so that the boomerangs return easier so that her damage is actually somewhat maximized. Because I feel like with Archetto over there and her just like passively increasing her SP like that, she can use her skill pretty often. So I feel like she's doing enough damage, even at this low of a level. This should probably kill some bosses. Do I feel like there's improvements that they could do to the the loot sniper archetypes already? Yeah, probably. Actually, you know what they would probably do if they ever do a shiori yuki um alter they could make her into a loot sniper i feel like that would be interesting because there's already characters that even just have a similar kind of thing but they just don't have the, the gimmick so they could probably have them actually going so far as to have like a really big attack speed boost on their boomerang or just have them have like five boomerangs coming out at once or whatever there's plenty that could happen maybe like range expand in some sort of direction what would be crazy is like a global expand, but, look you take has value. but it actually increases the attack, but because of the way that it is, it would take longer for it to return. So if they're just throwing it super far, then they would have to like do a ton of damage in that one hit. That would be kind of like a enough of a balance to where it, it feels like something that would do a module uh a module that just increases the amount of boomerangs would be crazy but it's kind of funny because sometimes modules are drastic and really good sometimes they're just like Okay. But I feel like even just an attack boost on her would be pretty good. I will say Diamante is not like super impressing me right now. I still want there to be a, a Matoid Maru uh, Musha altar someday. I feel like they'll do it. I don't know. It's very possible. Like they have some of these archetypes for characters that they introduced really early that they could a hundred percent specialize them into. Also, I'm looking at some variation on all of that. Motori Mara is pretty cute. Yeah. Big Oni. Oh, he gets their horns stuck in the um the door the doorways of things. Stay safe and keep in contact. Remember, 
The mission comes second. Your lives come first. I still remember that voice line of like remembering how much I have super random basic Japanese understanding from having watched various anime. Everybody has that, I think. Well, everybody who has paid attention, I guess. It is nothing impressive, but it's just like, oh, she said sumo. That means horn. I know what that meant. Crazy. <laughs> Big horny woman. Found the sarcasm enjoyer. Although I, I guess Tsukinogi kind of counts too. Those are more antlers than horns, though. And it's all keratin. Who cares? I would like for there to be. Hmm. I guess I don't use Tsukinogi specifically herself very much, but others of her type I do use a lot. I like putting them in. I doubt your ability to achieve your ambitions if coping with this was beyond you. Oh, you really didn't mean that? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm very used to um, VTuber chat type things where people will make that joke on purpose. Where it's like, oh, they said horny. Oh, ho, ho, ho. This is why I laugh, I suppose. Welcome home, Doctor. You know how it is. Hmm. All right. Hey. Sorry, my brain is just like racing, trying to figure out what all I need to do. Oh no. Oh, wait a minute though. It still hasn't said more. Amiya is not my cousin, however. Have you heard of... Have you heard of... Oh yeah, that's right, there is an event. I forgot. I genuinely forgot that there's also an event. Uh, I guess I'll do that after this. I'm just getting my ducks in order trying to get these characters some uh, love here. But have you heard of this? <laughs> have you heard of this character? Have you heard of Air Scarp? Because I think if you haven't, it should be pretty obvious. This is my cousin. I am glad to have more, or like at least one more bunny. Am I 100% happy with her kit? Maybe not, but I mean, it's not like she's not worth putting in. Uh, hold on. I'm glad that you're, you've gotten to the point where you're able to just like I'm dive into doing running stages, running. at least. I mean, I guess it's always like the first, the first ones aren't usually the problem. And it's usually a little later when that starts getting to be an issue. Yeah, some of those, some of those can be pretty brutal. I, I do remember. 
<laughs> Though if you have Lapland, I mean, those floating spiders are pretty much nothing. But I'm used to the darkness. If there's too many of them, then there's the light. This can always be a problem. Then you would have to have other characters to inflict silence very, very quickly in localized areas. Kotatsu. Where's the Kotatsu? I need to keep away from the electronics. Which they do have characters like that, of course. What am I doing today? Oh yeah, that's right. I was uh, stocking up on a bunch of gold bars. Hold on. Let me fix the base in a second. I just need to check how many I have already. Welcome home, doctor. Hmm. Let me check the depot. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me also get the certificates. Because I think I have two of those um, thingies anyway. I can just buy two of these grindstones. Yeah, I can. Oh, not, not that many. I have to wait until tomorrow to get all of these, but... Oh, well... I do like Caper a lot, honestly. I wonder. I mean, I guess I could just get another dupe of her. Just to lower that cost to 13. But I have this for chip catalysts, honestly. Uh, I think that's going to be like maybe 999,000, something like that. Wait, hold on a second. I didn't realize that this meant honeyberry and pudding were gone. Wait, unless I did something, did I do something? Wait, did I max honeyberry and pudding on here? Oh, I did. Okay, never mind. Sorry. <laughs> that that made me panic for a second. I didn't realize I had done that. Wait, are all the all the outfits that I wanted gone? They are. Mean. They're right there. Oh well, I got paid today. I couldn't have gotten any of them really. Uh, let's see. Which ones do I want out of these? Obviously I have zero need for the Texas one because I do not have you. Uh, Moomar. I mean, that's kind of cool, I guess, but yeah. Oh, Scotty Alter. Oh, how cool character I don't have. I do, um, I actually do have this on the second account, though. I found it worth to get. Oh, Gladia. But, but it looks so similar. And I like her tricorn hat. I don't know. It's cool, but it's like, kind of trading on the same kind of ground as the regular one, I would say. That's a really cool Sora outfit. And yeah, like, you know, I, as much as I, I like Melonar, you know, it's not that different. The Absinthe, probably going to get that one. Probably. Because I really like using Absinthe. Um, but doesn't sound great out of context, but... Uh... Ashlock. That's a really interesting outfit. Huh. I kind of like it. Uh, that plane. 
I'm not getting that one. It's not bad. It's cool. It's a uniform. But I'm not getting that. I don't know. Cool, cool is cool sometimes, but I, I kind of like cool and different a little bit more. Um, I do not have passenger on this account. I have him on the second account. And yeah, no, the, the Radiant Knight. It's a cool costume, but I feel like this is very, very similar to her normal one still. So I'm not like... I, I know the other thing is like they will change the effects of animations and sometimes change animations entirely, but I'm not like, eh, not too into that. If it's like similar already. And yeah, the Coral Coast one for Warfarine is great, but apparently it's gone right now, so that's too bad. Maybe they'll bring it back some way. I do like the Sora outfit. It's interesting because most of the time she doesn't really uh, have like official ears or anything. She's suspected to be, well, not a human or anything because humans don't exist, but she doesn't disclose what type of, um, well, Kimono Mimi, she is. So it actually changes between um, E1 and E2, I think. Uh, that's that's cool, but it's also Wish Wish Slash, and I never use Wish Slash. So, see, even with this one, I feel like this one's a bit similar to her regular one. I mean, it just sort of looks like a regular one, but she's not wearing pants. I guess that's great for some folks. Jay looks so depressed. <laughs> I, don't, I, I feel like his uh, change in job here has not helped his mental health whatsoever. Unfortunate. And this one just, this one looks like everything that Mountain wears already. I don't know. It doesn't look too different to me. Um, I never really use Courier. I never really use Vigna that much. I mean, I've always wanted to get this one anyway, though. It's kind of cool. I don't think it changes the effects on what she does. It just changes the look, so... I don't really like this one that much. I guess maybe it seems a bit plain to me. Obviously, these are like, you know, I, I feel like the artwork and everything is beautiful and all that, but there's like other ones that are... I mean, she even has a live 2D one already that I have, so I think I would really get that one. I actually thought that I got this one already, but I must have ruled that I don't use Sugi Nogi enough. To warrant it. I thought I got this one too. Well, I guess not. Um Yeah, this one's not really all that different either for him. I know that this one has like a very shiny effect on it. I think I got that one on the second account. Yeah, not my thing. I always wanted to get this Glaucus one, too. But these are not, like, urgent ones, I would say. In maybe all of these cases. Especially the ones back here that always kind of come back pretty frequently. So, of all of the ones that I saw here, I guess maybe Absinthe and Ashlock I would get. Maybe Gladia. Maybe Sora. Oh yeah, that's right. This is the section that I'm definitely not going to be looking at or spending anything on. 
So if any of these disappears, it must be a bug. I don't really feel the urgency to do anything to do with that today, though. I mean, there's there shouldn't ever be urgency, but it's just like rolling on characters and stuff like that. I mean, that's I guess I'm more accustomed to figuring things part of the game, obviously. But do I need absolutely everyone or whenever there's a limited character? Do I always need the limited character? No. Are you interested I have so in many characters. What is this? When this operator is assigned to a trading post, when Ena, ugh, I don't have Enos. Thanks a lot. Thanks for reminding me. All right. Well, not using that, then. This place might be far from a Lysanian mm. spire. But I still prefer the feeling of standing on solid ground. Well, just move some of these in. The wiring in his room. After this, terrible. I'll start Who the event. This? I think. I'm gonna sort every. What kind of place is this? Huh? This, this should probably be a better test. Of all of these characters. Wait, is this the bottom two ones? Uh, I'll put that back. Because I, I took it off for a little bit. My fingers are itching for guitar strings so bad. Now that's styling. Who said that? Hmm. Uh. I guess I'll get you three. Or maybe these three. Rhodes Island the Rhine is always people. so lively. Hmm. Let's really decorate this place. Mm, It'll I'll be cozy in no away. time. Promise. Careful with the moisture proofing. I hate the smell of rotting wood. Hmm. The moisture proofing. Okay, who's here? I guess I stole somebody by accident. I really wish Londinium's workers could have an environment as fine as this. Hmm. Okay. So now I have a bunch of metals and I don't have to worry about it for a bit, but I will go ahead and Set these bottom two back to... Oh, let me just... We'll finish that off. And we'll go back to this. Honestly, when does the base leave the beta? Is my huge question. Because I don't think it has even in the CN version yet. So other than something like what they just did, which was add the multi, um, the multi rerun thingy. My other most anticipated thing is like, what else are they going to do with the base? When are they going to expand it? I would like to know. Okay, I think I'm gonna go ahead and start. Welcome home, Doctor. The event. See how far I can get. I will admit it's nice not having having to hit the collection thingy on like that the resources event that they were doing before. I mean, hit that at, at like after doing anything all the time. It wasn't annoying or anything like that. That's just like, it was just a thing to do. I 
I feel like this is probably not running as its best because I'm streaming, but oh well. a candle. For reference, she's often called Candle Knight and as a boss. This place reminds me of Elden Ring. that one tower. All the mages in it. Was that open holds? See, stuff like this really does make me want to play the story for it, but I just don't really like to do it on stream very much. I don't know. Maybe one of these days I'll feel like I have enough time to just sit and read everything. But most of the times I just want to get to the stages. I do definitely appreciate whenever they do these animations, so... Because they do so much to introduce everybody. Sets up some kind of mystery. And let's see the shop. Hmm. Is this a smaller one? Uh. No, it's not a smaller one. Okay. I could definitely use some of these for sure. I don't know. Actually, oh, that's right. Even farming some of these events is going to be a lot easier. With the um, recovery thingy. Or the rerun thingy. Ordinarily, I read the summaries, but I don't even think I could read a lot of the German on there. Not anymore. It's not a difficult language, though. Wait. What is this? What is all this? What is happening there? Uh oh. What have they done? Alright, let me... Let me get... Both are not have. 
Some crucial class I don't have here. And I don't have any. I guess it's always good to have more healers. I understand the objective you've set. I will have a pharmacist here. What does the stage music sound like? <sighs> I did the stretch from the other redeem now. Avoid becoming engulfed in snow. I feel like you. Oh. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to boomerang this guy. <laughs> what should I do? A little bit of bravery in you to stand as my enemy. Oh, that's awesome. Curbing the enemy's weak points post haste. Every look you take has value. What interesting music. I love this game. Please trust in me. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting? For? Watch out! Here comes Burning Dwell! They're kind of handling them on their own. Okay, necrosis damage. Please deliver my visions to the masses. Don't believe it written across your face. Awesome index, I think. Oh, wait, no. We'll do the stainless. It's a good right? place for me. I'll have you. Generating. Every look you take has value. Okay. And we'll give him one more. I can read you like an open book. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. I don't even think there's going to be much else going on here. So. Here we go. All my enemies. I will Almost nobody's really attacking very much now, so. We'll just fast forward this. I don't think we really need the. Oh, that was a bad time to use that. Every look you take has value. Oh well. I don't think there's really much detriment to what I'm doing at the moment. As you wish. Every expression you make is how will you struck? How we go from the beginning to the end. Mm -hmm. What are you waiting? Let's have the spring well! Mission accomplished. I didn't like what I, I like the setup of everything for sure. The music and everything. Let's see. With your axe and wit, you have left your mark on the ice field. Now, what does now this mean? We can continue our journey forward. What could that possibly mean? Oh, the Herzenfolgen has unlocked. But of course, the Empress's celebration approaches. 
celebration and commotion coexisting under the spires of Zwillingstone. Zwillingstone? Wait, Zwillingstone. Wait, was this boom out? Ooh or uh? I forgot. Umlaut? No, I don't think so. No, it's Umlaut, isn't it? Ah, whatever. Many outdoor concerts have been interrupted by unidentified, unidentified noises being forced to stop their performances lately, throwing the capital into serious disorder. But the troublemakers are nowhere to be found. One evening, you receive a mysterious letter sealed with gold wax. Accept the task and investigate the incident as you walk the streets of Zwillingstern. Zwillingstern. This is why. Oh no, it's not why. Zwillingstern? Hmm. Uh, if I can't get any sort of clarification on that, then I'm probably going to keep pronouncing it wrong. An expert in witness interviews and extracting key clues from your conversations. Use Originium Originium Arts to collected clues and the appropriate inner tune to reproduce this witness's mood. Pry into what they actually saw and piece together the truth. What on earth kind of mini game is this? Covert visitations. So this is all some sort of detective thing, huh? Interesting. Do your investigation to get a clearer picture of what transpired. Clues will point to some particular and relevant individuals who will show up in succession. Authorization warrants are being required to investigate these individuals. Tap the magnifying glass next to covert visitations for more details. Replicate the subject's mood you will need to choose an inner tune that matches their aspect and way of want. What? In addition to covert visitations, daily routine visitations within, with witnesses will also be required. If you can complete up to three visitations a day, make sure to complete them in time or, or uncompleted visitations will not carry over to the next day. Replicating that will require an inner <laughs> this is so much. Why? Visitation procedure. My goodness. Okay, okay. So, in summary, you click on people. You click skip. You click continue questioning. Click skip. You continue questioning people. fine arts tune so you have to play music for them and cast spells on them based on what oh worldly desires are more suitable given her environment of Hmm, replicate the mood. So was there something to indicate about this? Or is it literally because of... Hmm. Could it be that you use the excuse of buying sausages to sneak out and relax? It really seems like you would need like the entire context of what's going on here to So I don't know what to do here. So is there a specific emotion that you can always Try and make. Way of want. Desire for. 
worldly things like food. Okay. So I replicate the scenario with the desire for worldly things. Emotions don't match. Okay. <laughs> what? So should I try and compose more tunes then? So this is a different desire for worldly things. Not vigilant, but pleasure. Um, Harkin the Arts. Switch in a tune. Oh, that's just for listening to the tunes, I guess. Joy's opus, desire for worldly things. Huh. Subjects of motions and match. And I got the investigation. Okay. Uh and you get a clue to the investigation, I guess. So I have to repeat that for all three of these characters, huh? Maybe that's something I'll do later, but what is this? Oh, it's just one of the resupply things. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, they definitely have this, um... Oh, wait. That's right. I guess I can unlock... Wait. Over at visitation. Oh, okay. Well, that was just the other one to unlock after that. Yeah, they do sometimes have these somewhat involved subsystems and things like that, which I do appreciate to a degree. For sure. I wonder. I think I probably need more money at the moment than anything, but... I'll just keep that on hold because I still need to, I still need to upgrade Welcome everybody's skills today. actually. Cause I am noticing that people are falling behind a little damage. I definitely can't wait till tomorrow to be able to level this character up. Cause I'm curious what kind of max damage she can get and obviously she's not gonna have like a module for a little bit but i feel like the type of attack definitely benefits from the chunk of damage being done being a lot bigger but i mean what's a character that you couldn't say that about i don't know seems like it's cool when they have more damage okay four of those we can do that, I think. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, and... Ah, man. Do I... Wait, is that from... Oh, no. Never mind. Okay, so that's 34 and 40 to 33 and 37. And that's attack speed plus 75. That's actually like a decent boost. I feel like as much as I'm um, lamenting being unable to like get this, I mean, I could literally just sit and farm anything now very easily with like the six runs in a row i mean that's way more than the one run in a row and forgetting about it so 
Hmm. All right. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to do enough of this to unlock. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. It's not traditionally the same, it seems. So do I have to do these investigations in order to get Lessig or Lessing rather? Do I just get him automatically? Or do I have to do all of them? But with fear and unease, it says. So do I have to do enough? Fear and unease. Fear. Sorrow. Fear, unease. this remorse and desire for wisdom that doesn't actually sound like anything I want you're an unease timorousness of course so in order to get these notes I do have to clear the stages so Presumably, there's some selection in here that's like crazy. Motions don't match, okay. So I have to search for clues in order to get Lessing then, huh? That is interesting. I suppose if I don't have to sit here and do the story in order to unlock the character then that is one case well, well this one case I could make for like not having to sit here and play the events but I kind of want to do it anyway just because I want to figure out what the gimmick is so we shall see Buy the music? Uh-oh. Oh, okay. So there's something visually indicating the music. Three musical variations in battle. Passionate or melancholic. So just as time goes on, it passes through. Okay. No, reducing the defense, though. So we'll even resonate and gain special abilities. My goodness. I'm pretty sure that's going to come back to bite us. What are these? Oh, you can just switch them. Okay. You can just switch them then. Wait. Oh, one way art screen. Wait, what? Uh, oh. 
to have to beat this thing up. There's, there's a lot going on right now. Phil knows they're under control. Wait, how do I do it? their attack speed, but their attack itself will be greatly increased. This effect is only momentary. Okay. That is interesting, for sure. I feel like I know what's going to happen though. There's going to be some stage where there's like a million of them. Shall I open? Get out right now! It's game over for you. Hmm. Hey, you still up? Oh, okay. You are. It does fit the music somehow. I mean, not somehow. Everyone, follow me. Here. We're known for this at this point, being a, a music company first. Here I am. Please, come to your oh my goodness, that's a lot of damage. There you are. Mission accomplished. Okay. Achieved a perfect victory, but we still can't let our guard down. It is always just weird seeing plain old Amia. Tell me. Hmm. So, what does that all translate into in terms of what my party can do with it? Because. I don't really feel like there's particular huge advantages to the people that I picked just now. So I don't know. I mean, other than they're all musically inclined, I suppose. I'm gonna make this hard to play without uh, sound. I feel like I do that a lot. Okay. Let's see. There's actually something I did want to do still. Welcome home, Doctor. Because now when I do be right back screens, I can just sit this to the loop. If I really, really want to. So, I mean, oh wait, is this the one that I I did with? Oh no, never mind. So yeah, technically, wait. Okay, I can actually just sit here and do this. I mean, why not? All right, I will be right back. Hold on. Technically, I can make myself disappear. Vary the habit of fighting, each to your own. Please, trust in me. Oh, well, let me do that. Hold on. In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. All right, I'll be right back. The firelight. I shall ensure the integrity of the law. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences.
This gavel of justice is waiting. Spero che sia tu pronto. No need to fall back. I obey my own heart. Uh oh, I might drop the scarecrow. Heavy defenders are so scary. <laughs> Just kidding. Agony ever etched on our hearts. Good place for me. Yeah, the firelight. Grief ever echoes in our souls. Target confirmed. Your life is mine to protect. The most naive behavior. I know what it is I want. Fear not. Would your face push it this way, okay? Thanks. I'll pay attention to how much force I use. Harder on the outside, the softer on the inside. Fear not. We've gone astray. Remember, everyone, not one fewer when we come back. In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. We've got I am Dublin. I shall ensure the integrity of the law. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. Gavel of justice is waiting. Spero che sia tu pronto. Thank you. I obey my own heart. I am double. Skyro, nori nori no chuku de iku yo. Uh oh, I might drop the scarecrow. Offense isn't what I trained for, but hey. Agony ever etched on our hearts. I obey my own heart. Down to work. Mala, now ignited. Grief ever echoes in our souls. Target confirmed. Grief ever echoes in our souls. This week, that's fighting! Destruction is the most naive behavior. I'm aware of what I'm doing. Should this way, okay? Thanks. I'll 
Pay attention to how much force they grief. Ever. The harder on the outside, the softer on the inside. I obey my own heart. Your life is mine. But, excited. Angel bones will strike your self in its shading Things are different. I don't want to hide myself any longer. Please, trust in me. In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. You've got to clear out the firelight. I shall ensure the integrity of the law. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. For more than just the law. Also the justice and virtue that exceeds the wrong path. I'm aware of what I'm doing. Plant looks risky, who can tell? Plant looks safe. You're in town. Ever etched on our hearts. We've gone astray. Down to work. Your life now ignited. Your life is mine to protect. The most naive behavior. Fear not. Hold your breath now. Fear not. Destruction is the most naive behavior. I know what it is I want. I dropped a scarecrow. Things are different. I don't want to hide myself any longer. Please, trust in me. In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. You've got this endless burn. You needn't bear. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. This gavel of justice is waiting. Spero che siate pronti. No need of a back. I obey my own heart. This endless burn. You need me for. Sky Dio, Mirai, Vabatini! 
What blocks the way, I will burn through. Your lives are mine to protect. This is the position, right? I know I am Dublin. I shall ensure the integrity of the law. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. More than just the law. Also, the justice and virtue that is no need to hold back. We have gone astray. This endless burn. But we need you to help. I don't need to help. I don't Plant looks risky. Who can tell? Plant looks safe. You're in. Almost done. There. I'm not eating, Down just drinking work. some water.
Move out. Too bad. These people have already been contaminated. In that case... In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. You've got I am Dublin. I shall ensure the integrity of the law. Judge by appearance and suffer the consequences. Gavel of justice is waiting. Spero che sia più pronto. No need to hold back. You've gone astray. Fear not, Mufayla. Sky, Nori Nori no Chokude Ikuyo! Uh oh. I might drop the scarecrow. Offense isn't what I train for, but hey. Grief ever echoes in our souls. I know what it is I want. Make it a good place for me. Fear not the firelight. Grief ever echoes in our souls. Target confirmed. Your life is mine to protect. This is a trick to you. Grief. Target confirmed. I'm aware of what I'm doing. It has now occurred to me that uh, optimizing some of these runs is going to be pretty important. Particularly now. Oh, wait. I appear to have frozen. One sec. Don't know how that happened. Mission complete. But I guess we'll just put this up for now. As you can see, wait, as you can't see, that's because certain things. Hold on. I move the PNG a little bit. But yeah, after doing those runs, or those six runs in a row, I mean, it. It worked. I got some LMD, I got some regular drops, I got some special drops. I don't know. It's not as though it makes, like... I mean, obviously, yes, that makes a difference. A significant enough difference. But... Wait a minute. Why is that still not working? That's confusing. Oh, okay. I don't know what's what his deal is. Sorry about moving the mic. I guess it just got all wobbly. Is it like detecting something else? That is quite odd. I think maybe it's just like hitching something. I don't know.
just this should be fine. I'm actually not too sure why it's <sighs> hold on. Maybe that's one of the reasons. Maybe it was like reflecting. Weirdly. I don't know. Ooh. Okay. Wait, why is it doing that? Hmm. Almost seems like it's catching on something else. I don't know what that's about. Cause I'm I'm perfectly situated here. And it's like moving. Oddly. I don't know. And I know it hasn't been doing that this whole time either. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess I could just go to the proper 2D. Well, not the proper 2D, but do this. Uh, hold on. Let me, let me show you what this is. I mean, I usually do this for other stuff, so I'm not too terribly concerned. Let's see. For some reason I have to, ooh, not that. Relaunch the thingy. There we go, here's this. But yeah, I, 3D does not seem to want to work today, so I suppose I'll just write out the rest of this with this. At least I don't have to put the stupid light on myself, right? I'll admit that was starting to bug me, so I'll probably be able to stream significantly longer with uh, just that going. I'll admit that is still one of the worst parts of doing it this way is just having a bright light shining on myself all the time. But, you know, it is what it is, as they say. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do something for a second because I am curious about one of these little things in here. Not for no reason or anything, but I am quite curious about the idea of, wait, which one of these has Ah, allows you to select the six star operator from a past headhunting pool. Oh no. Okay. Well, that's obviously going to happen. Because let's be real here. I have not, I have not made any single indication of the fact that I could possibly resist doing this, but what's crazy is I literally want all of them. So, you know, I can deal without Mizuki because I have Mizuki on the other one. I can deal without 
passenger. I have passenger on the other one. Palace has been evading me for so long. But the only other issue is I... Cuba has been also evading me. Lynn is on the other one. But Enos especially. You know what? All right. No, I'm getting Enos. Here's why. Because I still have this obsession with stainless. Therefore. And now I, I literally have a character that relies on me having Enos for their base skill to work. Like, it's almost a no-brainer. But I really hate that this means I'm missing Palace again. It does also mean that for events like this, I'll probably be able to get Palace from here or Kubai. So I do feel like this is worth it. So let me just, you know, I, I'm just not even going to hide this. Like, I have wanted these characters for quite some time, so I don't feel too bad doing this. I've missed Enos a lot. So, obviously, I'll do that. You promote us a hired six star to Elite Two Level One. Hmm. And then a bunch of primes with it, I guess. Now, do I feel like that would be worth it though? Hmm. I mean, frankly, I do, but. Because I would just be able to use that and then use the other thing to just get her all the way to well hmm but this one directly is just like it's a catalyst model module data block data supplement instrument data supplement stick what is that Is that those things? No, those are the vouchers. I don't even know what those are. Data supplement instrument. Wait. Hold on. What is that? Data supplement instrument. I don't know what that is. Oh, wait, is that? Oh, okay, that's these. Uh, I don't really care that much about those. I don't like doing that mode where you have to get those, so. But. I'm just trying to see if this. Larger pack is a little bit more worth it in terms of some things, but I kind of feel like, well, for one, the, the framing of the worth of primes is completely different now because you can just crack those to get more LMD and now you could properly farm with I mean, even though it's just like six runs in a row, that's way, way more than before. So I don't know. Actually, here's something. I'll just do these things one at a time. So if I feel the need to have any more, then I'll get more then. 
this is also going to be around for a while, so I don't really feel like I need to rush. Ugh. Never mind. That's very unsatisfying. Hmm. Well, until that happened, I was all gung ho. But the whole point here is that I'm using this to get Enos. No questions asked. Ascalon should have showed you my files. Messenger or mercenary, you ask? Doesn't matter. All you need to know is that I'm not after your life for now, Doctor. Hey, yeah. Either way, it's, um, it's a long time coming, I think. So. Uh, do I swing for the top operator thing, though, to just, like, skip having to do anything with her? Because I feel like at the point where I'm at with my resources, like, I'm not even sure I could really do anything with her. I mean, I guess I could just have her around normally like this. Because, like, I don't really need so much. I don't Are think. you sure I need to watch these? Back in Castell, you used to lead my people. Well, wait a minute. Let me do a couple of runs of these. Ah, oh, that's so nice. Just two. Just two. Wait, actually, no. Let me not do it this way because I want to put units in there. No. I, I think I'll, I'll keep Enos normal in a sense, cause you know, why not? I feel like there's precedent for doing so. Um, what's this? In the workshop, can I? Get any Vanguard chips here? Wait, ah, that just makes me want to get the thing though. So I could just go ahead and properly the user. This is purely impatience, I suppose. Because, I mean, technically, what I could do is try and level her normally. Or swing for this top operator pack and just warp her into Elite 2. Just automatically. You can promote a hired 6 star to Elite 2 level 1. It really would save so much time. And it would give me more primes. And technically, I do have another one. Or, I could get the chip choice and just level her normally. Or I could wait. I could wait until her area is open. Wait. When is that open? Because, I mean, I'm going to be playing tomorrow. Kind of the long and short of it, like anything that I would spend further than this would be purely for impatience sake. So, I mean, I could simply just not use her today while I'm playing and use her tomorrow. Actually, I think I'll do that. Uh, forget putting her in there. I, I don't care. As promised, 
disturbing the enemy's pal- Hello, everyone over there! You can breathe easy! What's the line? I'm just your average mechanic! I think overall, I am still more interested in leveling up paper, That's honestly. Good place for me. Every expression you make Cause Enos happen. was like, unexpected bonus here. To all my enemies, I will crack you down. Every expression you make is an opening. Order acknowledged. The other part that I can think of is that there's more, I don't know, off of this banner in particular, which I'm planning on rolling on, of course, I'm going to do most of the rolling tomorrow, or like tomorrow morning, because that's when all of this stuff for the month resets, so... I kind of need to know who I'm gonna get from there. I can read you like an open book. If I can get more people from there, I mean, that'd be that would give me an idea of whether or not I just want to skip somebody to six star or to elite two or not. I don't know. I'm I'm kind of fascinated by the fact that the distance does so much with her damage. I'm also to the point of wondering if I could just get like those material packs and just try and do it that way. I mean, it's it's silly, of course, but I don't really have to do that though, because technically I could just. Just Alright Here's what I'm going to do I'm going to redo 410 I'm redo 410 Right now I feel like I'm on a tangent again Because I was just doing The event you make is an opening we can leave now I'm sure no witnesses oh. okay I got this done I really do like that so much it's very helpful but welcome home doctor oh let me mark her down to. But yeah, un unexpectedly getting Enos is like a blessing and a curse because I'm just very strapped for resources at the moment. But I mean, it doesn't really matter as long as I am able to, you know, just get more. And being able to do this makes it very easy to get more. Oh yeah, that's right. I had a special thing going on for this. I don't think I'll need two, but actually, yeah, I don't really think I'll need two for this. I think it'll just drop normally. If this conflict truly is necessary, so it really is no way around it. We are happy to I will not back down. do one, but Get out of it, guys. whose car is this? Can't you feel the city's crumbling away? I have no doubt. I have to get serious now. Hmm. 
I do feel like there's, there's a little bit of like a okay my brain is going through diminishing returns at the moment because I know that I need to go to bed earlier for so long target confirmed can't you feel the city's crumbling away it is only 9.4 which is not very much at all but i already feel like what i'm tending to do right now is like i was pretty good wasn't i doctor is lean more towards doing a lot of the stuff that i would just do sitting in the discord it's not as though i don't want to stream dark knights tonight but in particular right now i don't really feel like doing the event i did i did one stage of it but like what if i instead did more of the event tomorrow evening and then you know just stuck with it did a lot of this uh background noise type stuff because i mean today i got i got caper i got diamante i got enos like stuff happened I will admit, I'm not like gigantically keen on Diamante's uh, abilities at the moment. Explosion at max, looking enfeeble. I feel like I need to see specifically what the enfeeble does to people. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my usual. Like I can never stop running this stage ever. So we'll do it one more time. Oh, okay. That's literally me doing that. I right. understand the objective. Where's Venus? Where'd she go? Um, am I? Oh, you know what? I could just use Enos instead of puzzle. Always an option. Okay, she's just down there, so. The next attack, attack deals 40%. Attack is arch damage to every, to the target for three seconds. It's two DP. Okay. Getting this crew together wasn't easy. I can deal with that. Make them count. Obviously, right now I can't really do much of anything else with her. But I already know that she's a character that I'm going to be using a ton. Do I feel like that warrants? Getting her to Elite 2 already? You know what? I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop beating around the bush. I already know what I wanna do. I wanted this character for a long time. The ones that I'm more iffy about are some of the newer ones. So, you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. And if I really need to level somebody else up or whatever, I can do that. This way I won't spend any more resources. This way. Because I don't want to end up having to get other stuff either. So. I'm just going to settle with doing this the way that I want to and using this character. 
as well, a little bit earlier than I thought I would. No regrets. For us mercs, life is war and war is life. The only escape is death. Our struggle will never end as long it's as it's not live. earned. But I got it. So I'll be happy. But uh, for now, I guess I'll just sit her at uh, 20 or something. Are you sure I need to watch <laughs> I'm these? definitely running out Back of stuff. In Kasdell, you used to lead my people. But now it doesn't matter. Because I can run many things at once. However, <laughs> should I keep doing that? right now or should I throw a cheeky uh, actually I'm gonna keep that I'm gonna keep those keeping the rocks because well especially now I have the ability to actually run some of these things so all right before if I unceremoniously leave, I do feel like I, I owe myself more of a try on some of these. I just wanted to be able to use Enos and I was getting down a rabbit hole. So I think, let's see. So she gains invisibility and steals attack speed from the target. Now that's crazy. Last until skill ends. So she can basically severely lower somebody's attack speed for a little bit. First deployment cost is zero. The shadow sentry. 90%. Retrieves the shadow. One DP for each. Well, okay. Those single deployment ones can be kind of iffy. Because I, I kind of like just having her on, on screen. Oh, her range expands for that. But it's auto recovery. Getting this crew together wasn't easy. You better make them count. I'm gonna try that one. Criteria, huh? Okay, so that one switches the music. I think the other reason why I still want to play the event mostly on stream is because when I'm off stream, I usually don't have the music on, so. All right, I don't know what the range expansion your bait, is. Yeah? that a different okay first hit on each enemy binds for five seconds it steals 90 attack enemies within the attack range lose invisibility oh she's another one with that interesting what are you waiting for? What? You got your best it is actually crazy how much more I'm interested in leveling caper than like everybody else though. 
Uh, let's see. I also kind of wish I had used it on him, but anyway, it's fine. It is very cool that Don't keep me waiting. everything that's going on has to do with the music. That's like crazy. But then. Venus is kit a lot, for sure. Also, there's there's nothing to this. I didn't even use the gimmick thingy. I didn't even use it. I didn't even think to use it. I guess nobody was pesking enough to perturb me. With your axe and wit. You have left your mark on the ice field. Now we can continue. So I have more of these things to play around with the songs. That's good. Maybe I pick up something for some other characters. But I feel like my my calling at the moment is to just like do the grindy ones like and I'm seeing that these visitations are also being rewarded here. But it also looks like you can just straight up get blessing from this so like if I have the right everything wait okay requires authorization click covert visitations earn rewards <sighs> hmm so do I have to un Wait. Do I have to investigate him six times or something? Well, that would take a lot of doing the event, that's for sure. Welcome home, doctor. So I guess technically if I were to do the event up to the point where I could repeat the event a bunch. Well, that'd be advantageous. Oh, I guess that's listening. Interesting. More horned people. Avoid becoming engulfed in snow. As were the oh wait, that's what they meant by ZTA. I'm listening. I mean, I guess what else could they mean, really? 
I do kind of like that she binds um, as well on the first hit, just because it's like a fairly long one. I know what to do. Don't order me around. So can I make it more intense? Or? Picked a good place for me. Okay. I didn't really have something better for him, but. Don't keep me waiting. Don't keep me waiting. Nothing can match the scent of despair. just a mode change for him i need to remember that Seize the moment. he's also only elite two or elite one but it's already 15k not 15k but 1500 that's crazy not one of you is getting away Ready all right let's things this way don't be better than your staff Okay. <laughs> I was just thinking, like, where did everybody go? Wait, here. Let's let's do it this way. About time for swing. Nobody is really all that much of a threat down there. I shall have the honor to pull the rise like a treasure. I really like her range a lot too. She's doing some significant chunks on there, I would say. Don't doubt you will enough. Time to end this. I need to get a better skill on him. I feel like he shouldn't be blocking anybody to begin with. Awesome, smooth, like So a butter. skill that affects his block <laughs> skill. Need any backup that time? It isn't really the greatest for me. Okay, so that other one where I was trying to get to the ZT8. That's just the end of this event. I mean, that should be fine. I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and shelve it for tonight. And I will see about coming back tomorrow for that. So. I do, um. Hmm. 
Where's my red and white? It is. Oh. No, I think. I think Hoshi's. Uh. I think Hoshi's leaving. Hmm. Well. I think I do know somebody who was in chat earlier. Well, I haven't really gotten much of a chance to actually raid yet. But she is somebody who I've played Lethal Company with. Um, you know. We've gotten a, a little bit of a chance to talk. I will. I mean, as much as I'd love to keep in the Arknights your family tonight. Let's see. I am playing Remnant 2 with somebody soon though. I don't know. Wait, Tony's playing Choo Choo Charles for some reason. That would be so silly. I've got options. Ultimately, I think I will leave it to... It's always nice to just, like, not raid anybody sometimes, but... I don't know why I'm sitting here, sitting here deliberating about it, either. Oh, wait, I see somebody playing... AFK journey. Eh. Stop deliberating. There's no reason. Anyway. I'll be Welcome real. Home, I... I would otherwise be, uh... I would be playing if only I could have stayed longer. this in the in the Discord VC and stuff, but I'm just not not quite feeling that tonight. Especially because I I want to attempt to go to bed a little earlier than usual. So thank you for accompanying me for this odd short Arc Night stream. I very much doubt there's anybody that's still here from a raid or anything like that, but I think in the spirit of Monopolis stuff, which I frankly have not been able to do too much of recently, uh, I will raid Hachi. Who is playing Remnant 2. If you're still around, thank you very much. We're going to keep it with the bunnies, though. And feel free to go meet another one of the people in Binopolis. Thank you for, you know. <laughs> I know this was like meandering and weird at the end. I'm trying to figure out all this stuff. But that's kind of how it is whenever there's an update on this game. Because... I like it so much, but I also Welcome fight home, internally on whether or not I should uh, stream it sometimes or whether or not I should just do random stuff sometimes. I don't know. It is my favorite game to stream. You'll often see me playing it. Yeah, you'll probably see me on this game tomorrow. Let's be honest. I'm going to break out Balatro, though. That's going to be fun. But yeah, I shall see you all later. Go say, go say hi to Archie. And talk to you tomorrow. What the?